if you could just go back in time and just give young Justin one piece of advice before he started that first business, what would it be? Pick a business model that's going to pay you a return on investment of your energy forever. Insurance, real estate, something that is residual. Pay attention to the business model and look 20 years ahead of you at your mentors and ask yourself if you want to be where they are. I'm going to, I'm going to ask on the flip side of that. You know, you're building an empire right now. You've already had tremendous success up until this point, but when it's all said and done, how do you want to be remembered? I would want to be remembered as a person that had a relentless heart. Um, I'm never going to be the smartest man in the world. I'm never going to be the best entrepreneur, but I'm going to do my absolute best to speak truth, even if it's not the best thing for me. And, um, and I want to relentlessly love people, even if I have to take arrows in my back. So I was just telling you in the car when we went to go get gas, it's like one of the things I love most about helping young men and young women, but young men particularly, is that I get a lot of hate for the things that I say that are just truth and people don't like. Those arrows in my back are well worth it because I feel like we're, we're changing a generation of young men in a positive way. And I think that people miss that if we help young men become better men, stronger men, that we are helping young women. And so I'm not the Pope. I'm not the world's greatest person or anything like that, but I am very relentless about caring about people and loving people. And uh, I quite enjoy it. And um, it never gets old getting messages here and you changed my life. So, um, yeah, just relentless and, and big hearted, man. And uh, everything else take care of itself. <laughs>